IFC Beam Import Basis Module, allows to import a building model from IFC 4 and IFC 2X3 formats along with structural elements, installations and building equipment elements. The structural model of the building, visible both in 2D view and in the 3D view, can then be used to design the installation in the Install System 5 package. IFC Beam Building Data Interpretation Module enables the interpretation of structural objects from the scope of the building structure imported from an IFC file. The result of the interpretation are the appropriate native objects of the Install System 5 package that form the building structure ready for further work, thermal calculations of the building and designing the installation. IFC Beam Heating Cooling System Export Module and IFC Beam Tap Water System Export Module allow for the export of an installation designed in the Install System 5 package to the IFC 4 format. The installation export contains basic information about the name of objects and their properties, as well as an exact geometric representation of the objects. The new ground modeling function enables precise modeling and graphic visualization of the ground surface at the contact with the external walls of the building, which is necessary for buildings located on non-flat ground. Thanks to the editable labels of points on the boundary representing the contact of ground with external walls, it is possible to easily and intuitively define the elevation of the terrain. After performing the calculations of the building structure and thermal calculations, the external walls with sub-partitions and walls adjacent to the ground are correctly identified, adequately to the ground layout. Additional dividing points that you can insert on the boundary allow for further adjustments and free modeling. Using the 2D editing and 3D view windows, you can easily edit ground layout and verify the effect in the model.
In the general data window, it is possible to control the method of automatic creation of building units by selecting the separate for stories. Or common to entire building option. The aspect of dividing the building into units and assigning rooms to them has an impact, among others, on the ventilation airflow balance performed by the program. It is also possible to conveniently create building units from the 2D editor window by selecting rooms and choosing the create building unit for selected rooms function. The project browser window also allows to sort rooms according to their symbols. This function is available by right-clicking on the building unit level. Project browser window and the search window enable quick group selection and searching of elements on automatically generated schematic views. This makes it easier to edit the data of elements visible in the schematic view and the schematic view itself. The program's performance has been improved in many aspects. One of them is working on large underlays in DWG and DXF formats. Editing views of such files and switching between worksheets is smoother. The operations related to inserting elements, for example pipe runs, have also been sped up. Zoom in, zoom out, pan, rotate operations in the 3D view window have been optimized. These and other program performance optimizations should improve your work with big project files. For items, mixer, pump unit, hydraulic control loop, single and double manifold you can visualize variants of the orientation of these elements in space. This facilitates the selection of the variant adequate to the design situation. In the fittings tool group, the low loss header element has been made available, placed on the plan view and connected on both sides with single pipe run or a pair of pipe runs. Before connecting, the element should be properly oriented because it has its primary and secondary sides distinguished. The type and size of the low loss header can be selected from the catalog. It can also be sized automatically based on the medium flow rate calculation.
In the fittings tool group, the expansion vessel element has been made available, placed on the plan view and connected with a pipron with no medium flow. Connection can be bottom or top. The type and size of the expansion vessel should be selected from the catalog. The following elements are available in the fittings tool group, pressure gauge, liquid thermometer and bimetallic thermometer. Elements are inserted into pipe runs on the plan view or in the 3D model. In the data table, you can select a straight or angular figure. The way of presenting elements in the schematic view depends on indicating the front part of the element. For particular elements, the ability to quickly change the position of the imaginary front part of the element has been added, which affects the effect of generating automatic schematic view. Two new variants of orientation in the space of the mixer and hydraulic control loop elements have been added, which enables the correct connection and 3D presentation of the distribution network and terminal units in such a distribution system. In the installations where the source provides both heating and cooling output it is possible to uncheck the rooms which are not cooled. As a result program calculates accordingly reduced required cooling output of the source. It is also possible to specify the function of terminal units of the installation in the rooms, what analogously affects the required cooling output of the source.